Welcome back to the Chronic Corner. I'm Lauren, and this episode is all about autonomic dysreflexia. Now, of course, you've probably heard of the autonomic nervous system if you're watching this video. Um, it is basically the huge part of dysautonomia, but you may not have heard of autonomic dysreflexia, so we wanted to make a quick video to kind of go over just the basics of it. So this is when your autonomic nervous system has an abnormal or overreaction. Um, and this can result in symptoms such as a change in heart rate, a change in blood pressure, usually high blood pressure, um, excessive sweating, and muscle spasms, just to name a few. And you can actually have um, your skin change color, so you could become more pale, more red, it can turn a bluish gray tone, it all depends on, you know, you. And the cause of it is thought to be mainly from a spinal cord injury, but can be from all sorts of things such as a medication side effect or even a head injury, just to name a few. For treatments, there are kind of two go-tos that are recommended, and the first is to sit up and elevate your head, and the second is to remove tight clothing, which I find very interesting because with dysautonomia, you are always trying to find compression everything, compression tights, compression sleeves, um, compression socks, because you're trying to increase blood flow. So I found it fascinating that for autonomic dysreflexia, they tell you to remove tight clothing. Again, this is just the basics of it. There's a great um, article that we put the link in the description below if you want to learn more. And for more things dysautonomia and chronic illness, visit dinet.org. Thank you so much for watching.